hello this is video demonstration about a stock valuation module on which pragmatic has developed functionality using which we can analyze our stock valuation in different methods like fifo lifo and average methods so we'll see how this module work so this is a open erp menu in which initially we need to configure some details in product so go to product form this is a list of products which have in the system edit a product for which we want to analyze our stock valuation details and you can see here stock valuation method which helps to calculate a stock valuation by different methods as a fifo lifo or average method so as per a requirement we can select a method which uh, for which we want to see a stock valuation like average method fifo or lifo so we'll see for a average method so just select average method and save this product so next what so this stock valuation module helps to track a history for the stock valuation and this module also helps to provide a facility to see a stock valuation by monthly and yearly so as per a required period we can see a stock valuation so uh, we'll create one purchase order so go to purchase management menu in which we have a purchase order okay for this we select a product sonic swatch in which we selected a stock valuation method as a average enter a quantity and confirm this order so now my order convert to purchase order so invoice is waiting for validation and reception is created so go to reception product in 25 so go to a picking list so this is a input picking list for my purchase order 32 in which you can see a sonic swatch for a quantity just process it validate your product to process so now we can see that this input picking list is in a state of done so now go to a warehouse menu in which we can analyze our stock valuation so in a warehouse management stock valuation menu click on this so in which we have the stock valuation details so when we click on stock valuation we can see here a stock valuation line is automatically created for this product i have selected a average method okay you can analyze the real stock at close and stock value details and the state of this stock valuation when we edit this stock valuation stock valuation line is created for this record for this incoming shipment 025 and we can analyze here average price for this stock valuation and the stock value price journal entries so go to accounting menu so click on journal entries so our journal entries we can see my incoming 025 for this my journal entry has been created so if we edit this entry we can see here the journal items for this incoming shipment so you can see here the accounts details stock input account and the purchase accounts now we'll see how we can Uh, see the history for this stock valuation and how we can analyze the facility of this stock valuation for the stock per period and per fiscal year so go to warehouse management in which under a stock valuation stock per period and stock per fiscal year menus so click on stock per period under this we can see stock per period and stock per period wizard so we can create stock per period entry automatically by clicking on this wizard just just we need to run this wizard so you can see here the entry is created on stock per period my entry for this current month for the month of august previous month has been created which is in a closed state and the stock per period like for this current period which is in open select a period for which we want to run this wizard select a warehouse and click on this create button to run this wizard as you can see it provides a warning that you cannot create stock per period record for this current date so you can run this wizard for your previous month 
so in the same way we have created previous month so once this month completed you can run this wizard and you can create a stock per period details for this current month as well. in the similar way we can create this stock per a uh, stock valuation records for your fiscal year as well so in the same way we need to run a fiscal year wizard and we can create a stock valuation entries for this year as well so in this way we can see and analyze our stock valuation in different methods fifo lifo and average by using this stock valuation model thank you